a way to keep those zucchinis going well. You can make a relish out of them. I don't know how you're going to make a relish out of this guy. <laughs> yeah, sucker. Hello. Nice. How long does this take to grow? I like my vegetables that double those weapons. Seriously. Right? There we go. I mean, okay, come on. <laughs> In case somebody attacks me on the way to the, way to the car. Okay, well, a relish is a good thing that you can do because, of course, we're talking all about preserving flavors, yes. right? To keep it forever, for a long time. And really listen, long time. I understand this looks a little intimidating, and but you have to understand, when you, when you have the garden, you kind of get busy, you cater a wedding, you do something, you come back four days later, and your little cute <laughs> zucchinis, they look like this, <laughs> yeah, don't they? <laughs> and listen, and on the bright side for a relish, this is the kind of thing you want to use because yeah. you can go to the farmer's market where I got this, and they're like, just take it. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> we don't want to throw it out. They don't know what to do with it. Nobody yeah. does. What are you going to do? You're going to eat zucchini for like a week, and then after you're going to let them go, and they become that. Exactly. Yeah. I mean, uh, so we you know what we're going to do? We're going to no, put the three chefs do? to work. All right. Oh, oh yeah. No. You know, I know you We've guys don't well work so enough at the restaurant, so here we go. I need a julienne okay, I'll red take onion. That. Pepper, please. Uh, here we go. Uh, All right. And we're going to start breaking this thing down, okay? Tracy. Yeah? Big zucchini. What do you think? I don't know. Cut it. All right. Let's cut it up. Let's just make something, something happen here, right? Yeah. I thought it would be kind of nice to put these guys to work, and then you know maybe we could like start something up on Twitter, and it could be like you know, ah, cut myself. The cool. tomatoes come into season, and Massimo comes over and makes tomato sauce in your kitchen or something, right? That'd be awesome. Right. This is a one that. kind of thing. Let's do that. Why well, not? As long as he mm. cleans up afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Okay, Massimo went and his assistant. So listen, for a larger zucchini, <laughs> you want to take the seeds out, right? Because they're going to be a little large in there. And it says work in a food processor, but I always find that a food processor is a little dodgy on TV. Right. Very yeah, no kidding, huh? <laughs> and you know what? I always find you have better texture by hand, especially if you have some world-class chefs. Put them to work, right? Give me a little julienne yeah, in there. Woodpecker over here. Yeah. And then I'm just going to shave this on a box grater. Tracy, okay. there's a there little the piece of ginger there and a rasp. Yep. If you could just work a little bit of ginger through that rasp. And look at this. All four of us are going to be doing something, yeah. right? We're all working now. Massimo, and looking good, yeah. Got a little conveyor oh. belt here. I'm How are you doing over there? I need a break. Like, you need a <laughs> 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 And if you're going to call your you friends over to make relish, make sure you have enough wine or beer. Keep them entertained, That's right? That's the least you can do, yeah, really. Yeah, but before, before you... Uh, after you start slicing, huh? it's not good to use a knife. With well, that's the, how you trim the nails. Yeah, good call. Uh, good call, chef. Oh, look at that. yeah, we, no need time. Your, we, we need the onion goggles for him. Sorry. Right. Perfect. Throw it in. He's a throw trained professional. He's fine. Jason, how are you making out down there? Do you want this in there? Yeah, throw it in. Everything <laughs> goes in, right? You could use Ooh, the yellow as well. I'm a little right. ginger's good. And then what you need? Salt. So yeah. what we have to do is, the zucchini has a lot of water. It's almost like a mushroom. Yeah. So you want to just season this up, toss it around. You got that? And throw it into the fridge. Now they That's say teamwork right throw there. it into the Look fridge for at least two to 24 oh. hours. Okay. Two to 24 hours? Does that smell like Ooh. summer? That I would do it overnight like myself. Yeah. Overnight. And if your fridge looks like my fridge yeah. at home, you really don't have room for a large bowl like that, mm -hmm. throw it into a bag. The best, right. the best way. Now you yeah. can see there's a little bit of liquid coming out. Steal your wife's strainer. <laughs> All right. You don't have one? Dump that out. I get yelled at by everyone. Amazing. That's amazing. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> beautiful? <laughs> it matches the relish, right? <laughs> well, take that to work. Take that to work, okay? No, <laughs> listen. I get yelled at at home because I stake my wife's stuff, and I go to the restaurant, I take their stuff, and they yell at me, and they keep buying stuff. So just cost me money. It's all good, right? I thought it would match the zucchini. I think it's cute. Moral of the story, though, it works. Look at this. Look at all that liquid on the bottom. Thank you, Massimo. All right. What do you want to do? Next step on the flavor profile, we need some uh, some pickling spices. So, coriander oh, yeah. seed, right? Everyone's <coughs> favorite mustard seed. Hello, Love that. Mustard how you seed. doing? And celery seed. Did, were you mm. just talking to your mustard then? Well, what do you know? Yeah. Yeah. Is that important? Yeah. You gotta say You gotta say you. hi. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's let that go. See, it shows yeah. There we go. You know a little bit nice. so coarse it. pepper. They also call this butcher pepper. That'll get hidden inside, and then when you're eating the relish, you get a little bite, and it'll be like, whoa, what's that caught my teeth? It's a hot pepper. Okay. It's nice. <laughs> you want to kick it up a little bit more? Just some little chilies, oh, right? that's nice. Uh, that's good. You made that yourself. Get them oh, yeah, in we there. dried those yeah. ourselves. Get them in there. Just put it all in Get in there. Get your fingers in there. And then. Nutmeg, just a touch. Now it's important to toast them. You can, if you're sitting over here, you starting to smell that, guys? Yeah. You yeah. smell okay? No. All right. <coughs> we can bang the flavors into this sucker. Now, you ready? Then open the windows when you're doing the pickling. <coughs> You That's nice, isn't it? That or is no, that vinegar. goes, liquid goes in the garbage. Okay. Uh, right? This goes in. Now, 
you read a lot of recipes online that says stew it or boil it for 30 minutes. I really don't want to do that. I don't want to break down the texture, right? We've right. got this beautiful work by the boys. We don't want to break it down too much. That's right. So it's going to come up. All the moisture is still going to cook out a little bit. A bit of vinegar because we do have to preserve it. Natural mm -hmm. preservative, right? You got a white wine vinegar? White wine vinegar. Nice. Right? And that starts to stew. We need to just collect that liquid. So obviously you have to balance out the vinegar with a little bit of sugar. I'm using icing sugar because it also has cornstarch in it. Nice. And then it won't get lumpy. Oh. Right? <laughs> nice little trick. See what I'm saying? So then uh -huh. let that simmer for 15 minutes. Here's the aftermath. Check it out. We still have all of our texture. We got some yellow, some great, red. Randy. Doesn't that look fantastic? Oh, that's nice. yeah. Yeah. Smells right. aromatic. A little better than that one. <laughs> well, that one's been cooked down, Jason. <laughs> <laughs> and then look it. Put yourself in a nice little thing. And Tracy, why don't you look at that label? Oh, Tracy zucchini oh, relish. Oh, Thank oh, you very oh, much. It's from the pre-chef. There we go. Break. More coming out. Yeah.